What is up guys, John here, welcome back to another Destiny video. You can see Zer's behind me in the tower. It's Friday afternoon. Run. It's actually 2 o'clock right now. I would have had this video up a lot earlier, but last night had a power outage because some uh, branches fell on some power lines. And not only did uh, some power lines get uh, ripped off from the poles, cell phone poles, whatever, power lines, uh, so did our fiber optic cable. So that just all got fixed finally now. Uh, so I'm back. Here's a video just for the hell of it because, you know, I, I gotta post these videos up every Friday. And uh, I don't want to get out of the habit of doing that, of, like not posting them up again. But real quick, let's check what Zer has. He has the Tyco Knot. It is the astronaut looking helmet, all rocket launchers gain tracking. This I'm pretty sure we're going to see a lot of people maybe use during trials. Yeah, I'm sure a lot of people are going to use during trials. You know how like people would use like truths. I'm pretty sure we're going to see people switching off armors now. I've seen it before. Before the Taken King. Uh, with like the, uh, what is it? The ones that help you res, I forgot the names of it. The loopy chest and whatnot. But yeah, that's for the Titan. We also have the Graviton Forfeit, which is another great PvP exotic for the Hunter, which grants Shade Step. This is basically, in one way or another, it's like a new blink, but only if like you're on the ground, because, you know, you just roll out of, the, you know, some fire, roll into cover, or anything like that. And now we have the Alchemist Rainment. Unfortunately, this is not that much of a PvP or PvE. Well, sort of PvE chess piece, but I don't find it to be that useful at all unless you actually just want more heavy ammo, which is pretty... Uh, I, w I would say there's just better exotics than this. It's a cool looking chess piece, but definitely better exotics than this for the Warlock. So, 2 out of 3 for the subclass uh, this week for PvP, for Trials, which is really great. Now we also have the Zala Supercell, the brand new Taken King exotic uh, item that he has in his inventory. But I'm pretty sure a lot of people have been wanting to get. Uh, I haven't been seeing this much out of Angrams, but I have gotten quite a few of them myself. I know a couple of friends of mine might be excited to get this as well, because they did not have it. This works during great. This works great during uh, during the first part of the raid, up to the War Priest at least. And uh, it's just a fun gun to use overall. In PvP, I never really get the hang of it, but definitely a good gun to use overall. Uh, as the, uh, what is it, double kills. Double kills automatically reload your weapon, and it also chains, uh, like, lightning. Kind of, the way I describe it, it's like a mini storm caller as a gun. Pretty fun gun to use. And he also has a legacy special engram. For the Curios, he has Plasma Drive, Void Drive, Heavy Ammo Synth, 3 of Coins, Class Needles, and the Motors of Light. That's pretty much going to do it there for me, guys. I uh, hope you guys, a lot of you already probably picked it up already. He's all super well, Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one.